Evening everybody, Rich here, back for another Minecraft ship preview video thing. Uh, and uh, this is the RMS Coronia. This is the last ship that I have which was voted by uh, the public for a tutorial. Uh, I have not done a poll since, so uh, this is the last ship of the uh, selected few. And uh, this is what i come up with. This is... Well, it's sort of been sat idle for about six weeks. It has been finished a long time, but uh, the main debate was about the colour. So uh, the colour was meant to be... A light, a, a light green, but because Minecraft doesn't have a light green, we come up with this one. So this is what this is what the, was voted for the color. Um, I did give the, the options for three colors, but this is what was voted for. Uh, so a we'll quick fly around the ship. Uh, it's quite a gawky looking thing. It's it's the same scale as my other ships, like Titanic, Britannic, uh, Majestic, and all the other ones like that. So it's, it's to the same scale, but because I'm not using a shear. Once again, uh, where the hull sort of dips in the middle, the uh, ship does look a bit overweight, so that's the, that's the reason for its gawkiness, but nonetheless it's there, and it will look a lot better when it's sat on water, because that sort of just makes the hull look exaggerated when it's sat on land. But uh, a quick fly around anyway, it's it's sort of a, a scaled down Queen Mary, if I like, the, in terms of hull, but a fly around anyway. got white propellers on this thing as well, because I'm using quartz stairs and things to get the propeller design right. And uh, they don't look too bad. So a quick fly around the stern and up the other side, and uh, not really much else to say really. It's 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 a, it's a thing really, and it's it's a basic ship in terms of what other things I've done. But it's a more modern looking ship. It's not modern at all though. I mean the ship was launched in 1947 I think, and uh, sort of post-war era, and it looks modern, but it ain't. And also didn't survive very long either. I think only survived about 20 years before she was uh, decommissioned and. I think she sank somewhere. Uh, history sort of gone out my head at the moment, but I think she uh, sort of broke her moorings and sank in the storm or something. Uh, but that was that. So a quick fly around again. Is that the ship is a, a slightly not smaller scale, but the decks, the top decks are more compact. Uh, whereas most of the time I use a four block gap between each deck. The top three decks of this ship are three block gaps, so got a bit more. Uh, well, not, not as much space at the top, but it's mainly just for appearance, really, because the ship did look massively top-heavy when the uh, the decks were all the same. So that's that's the reason for that. So the ship is a bit more compressed at the top, but everything else is fine. A quick fly over the top. It's a, like I say, it's a fairly basic design. The lifeboats are fairly basic. I've, I didn't add much detail to the lifeboats, but some of them are motorized, some of them are not. So they're details that I need to add. But apart from that, everything else is as I intend to leave it. So we've got a swimming pool on the back. Got loads of pillar things, cranes, uh, masts, docking bridge, internal walls. And uh, it's not too bad. But like I said, it's been sat idle for about six weeks. Um, it's been finished about six weeks. It's just the colour that I need to change. In. But I just wanted to get other videos out of the way. And, uh, before we, and also the colour debate before we moved on to uh, actually previewing this thing. But uh, hey, we're all done now. So a tutorial for this thing will be commencing maybe next week. Which, if I start on the Monday, that'd be. I don't know what the date is, but if we go from the Monday from now, uh, we'll uh, start the tutorial from there. So I'm, just, I'm not going to leave as big a gap. Uh, so that's that. Um, and also, I'll probably put another poll up for the next set of tutorials or next ship, next set of ships available or ships I plan to build. And then I leave it for a public vote, so that'd be for that one. So this is this was the last of that vote, and uh, this is what I come up with. But that's it. That's the Coronia, or Corona, whichever you want to call it. And uh, she don't look too bad. A bit gawky, but she is to scale. So hey, here, there we go. Anyway, that is like I say, that's Corona. So this is Rich signing off, logging off, disappearing, and I shall return with another video soon. So um. Bye for now.